Hi guys, uh, I'm Kosh, and over here I have my friend with me, Krix. Hi guys, my name is Keith, also known as Krix. Actually, I want to talk to you more about uh, your your production. Yeah, yeah, like uh, about your songs and stuff. Like, could you tell us more about? Uh, I want to know more about. Let's say Lighthouse. Mm. Yeah, one of your tracks in your EP, right? Uh, you guys check out Lighthouse, right? So, uh, how do you you know like how you producers actually come up with the song like melody and stuff like? You just grind like a whole day in the studio or it's like maybe when you are walking to somewhere and you suddenly just think of a melody and then you try it and stuff like how how do you how do you get your you know? I think different different producers different producers will have different ways of approaching mm -hmm. their craft. Like uh you know hip hop producers we 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 look through samples and everything and then they will like chop it up and like put it in mm -hmm. you know to get the groove get the beat i mean for me for me uh i would usually find the find the key of, mm -hmm. a, of a song just decide on the key of the song and then from there onwards i'll count the chords first the chord progression and then after that follow up with with with, with all the rest of the arrangement mm -hmm. sometimes i also approach it in in with the drum with the drum group first mm -hmm. you know like the drum beat i'll come with the drum beat and then after that uh, follow up with, with the things on top depending on on, on what I, what the direction of the song is right. yeah so for for lighthouse right? for lighthouse yeah, yeah for lighthouse uh, what I did was was uh, mm. because I wanted it to be a melodic uh, more a more uh, melodic melodic track for the for, for the start okay. for the verse right so okay. I I came up with the chords first mm. and, uh, and, uh, and a melody for, I mean, in terms of the composition, I, I wrote a, a melody and a... Okay. So this is the first draft? Yeah. The very first part of life. Yeah, the very, very first part. The beginning! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I just came out with this after I... This, this, this simple melody and chord progression, right? For, for, for the singer. So Marisa was, was with you all along, right? I mean, we weren't, we, we weren't physically with each other, but after okay. this, I sent it over to her. And I'm like, hey, what do you think? And then, uh, and then I also sent her like this melody that I did. Yeah, over here. Because she thought the previous one was too high, you know? So the piano sound is actually what the acapella should sound yeah, like. Yeah, 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 exactly, exactly, yeah. Yeah, so you've got, you've got, you've got this going on with the build up and everything. And then it moved on to like a like a rough drop, you know, okay. just just for the make the sound, the idea to be fuller. Okay. And then yeah. like, you know what I mean? Okay, yeah, right. So so how many of these drafts you actually yeah, have got. before you actually get that final lighthouse onto the internet? Oh, I got like twenty over, man. I was I was still in the army when I was working on this track, okay. so so. So, well, it took me very long, about a year, because wow. I only get to come out on every weekend, right? Mm. So I'm restricted to like maybe at most two nights, okay. like two days a week to work. And the break, the one we break in between of working, we just jam up your process All right. of working. So like sometimes you have to like after taking after being away from the from the project for like mm -hmm. five days, right? Coming back. Sometimes things will be like a little like oh shit, this already this already thing, okay, you know what I mean? Okay. So what are the like what's the other difficulties that you faced apart from just having very little time because of um like are there any are there any maybe like arguments with your singer? Like maybe so far, you feel that this sounds better and maybe she feels that no it should be this way. Like I mean who gets to call the shots? I mean, so far, uh, you so far, or, uh, I don't really have a lot of problems in this in this kind of situation. Like, okay. I would usually just uh, give like uh, the people I'm working with the uh, like mm. have it they, they have it their way, you know, like right. easy to work with. Okay. Right? So if they think that this is nicer, mm -hmm. and I don't have much uh, disagree disagreement with it, right? Okay. And then I would just like, yo, yeah, sure, why not? 
But sometimes, you know, things that I, I feel that is strongly better if it's the other way, mm -hmm. you know, somehow they would just like, yeah, sure, you know, why not? Okay. So that in terms of in terms of this kind of situation, right? That in terms of collaborations, like there isn't really much friction. You know, okay. it's quite 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 easy to work with so far. Don't forget to check out his EP, Restart. And also don't forget to check out Lighthouse. It's over there in the description box. Yeah, right there. Check right out there. Lighthouse. Right, and we'll see you again next time. It's a coach and Crix signing off for RGR TV. Good night.